Yeah. Good morning, guys. We are here at the thrift right now, and the boo boo just got an offer. So we're gonna start off the trip to the thrift with an offer on Poshmark. Let's see what it is. It's on her boys' lie hoodie and sweats that I I actually found on a good one. No. Oh, not too bad though. A hundred. She listed it for well. two fifty. It's for both items. That's for two pieces though, so probably gonna hold off. It's all good. Scan the thrift, please. Found these fake cherry thirteens. I believe they're fake. They don't feel good, and the tag on the inside looks hella weird. But I did find these. I think these are legit. Size ten and a half for Jordan five. I believe these are called the green beans. Might be for the person though. We'll see. Thirty dollars. These are in pretty good condition. And then right here, find a little kid's unique little cause El Moti. And then just a basic Disney mini mouse. Okay, little vintage Nike on a white tag. Size XL. This one's cool because that's actually embroidered. It's a pink embroidered check. It's pretty fire. And then you guys saw that already, but this one right here, a little later, 2000s, the doors too, size medium. $12.99, but I'm still gonna scoop this one. This is cool. Found um, two Angels jerseys. These are the Flex. Um, it's called Flex. Flex Base. Jackson and Carew. And then this one right here, I guess it's like a um, Hartford, Connecticut hockey team that is non existent anymore. So that's fire, and then this is obviously crazy. You guys already know. Vintage 80s starter, Los Angeles Kings satin starter jacket. Super crispy too. Okay, two pairs of shoes, some Vapor Maxes, women's. I think people slept on these because they look like they're dirty, but this is actually the color they're supposed to be. And then right here, 30 bucks. Just gotta clean them up, but there's some Hall of Fame Jordan Blues. These are solid, so I'm gonna pick both of these things up. They're honestly not too bad. It's just dirt, so I just gotta clean them up. It should be straight. The white tag, size large, made in USA, $8. Essential. Big check on it. It's in like the cream colorway, so it's just fire. And then the uh, Chance to Wrapper, color tone tag, size medium, acid wrap, hoodie, little stone wash. Scooping both of these. Okay, another one. I honestly can't remember if I have the yellow one or the purple one. It's another vintage Nike baby. Six to nine months. Buying on the back. Super clean condition too. This one right here, asking thirty dollars, but I have to pick it up. Another Architect jersey, jersey jacket, women's though, size medium. And then the Detroit uh, Vintage Carhartt 15. This is solid. Size 42. Super clean too. Got this simple Nike check. Double XL. Year 2000s. And then Stussy long sleeve. Simple. Front and then the simple back head too. I believe there's a larger XL. Pretty clean. Yo, this is crazy. All 11, 11 and a half, and 12. I'm taking all of them, but I'll show you guys them later on. The homie just came up on all of these too. Sadly, these are the Nike IDs, but these Kobe's, these are obviously cool. And then these right here, they're just a little beat, but it's the fade to black. Twos. Crazy. Mm hmm. Independence Day. Kobe's, $45. Super good condition too. How much do they go Crazy for at 45? Crazy. Betty Boop, double-sided. On the freeze tag, 93 I think. Yeah, front and back. And then another Art T on the Hanes Beefy. Osamu James Nakagawa, it's a Japanese artist. Single stitch, y'all know how I am with the Art T. Another pair. For future A. Some bread fours. This is the one with the Nike in the back. Fire. 
Yeah, they got these. I was hyped. I thought they were actually bread donut ones, but nah. We got a vintage college Berkeley crew neck on the Galt Sand tag. The Playboy Festival, another one to add to the art collection. 2013, size medium. Then this one right here, 2009, basic. In 2004, this one's cool. It's got the flames on both sleeves from 04. Very simple, but the wash is clean. And then this one, Ride to Live 2006, front and back. This one's a maybe. I don't know about the blue shirt, but I like this one. And then this one right here, $1.99 screen stars, so Indian tea, 1991. <laughs> Vintage polo rock one with the corduroy collar, burgundy colorway. Nice little fade, brown collar, 15 bucks. I think these are the gym red mids, size 11, super beat. That's honestly how I like Jordan ones. These might stay in the personal, size 11. And then these right here are the Golden State Warriors, Nike Dunks, size 10. A little beat, but I feel like I can still clean these. Another pair of Vapor Maxes. These are in a size 13. I'm gonna try them on to make sure none of the bubbles are messed up, but 20 bucks. These will go the big bro. Nothing wrong with it at all. And then this one right here is pretty crazy. It's on the Optima tag, size uh, 2 XL. I'm not gonna say anything about it. If you know, you know. Priority records. No limit records on this side. And then the back. See murder trapped in crime. This was crazy. What's good, guys? Your boy just got to the post office. I got like nine. Got like nine packs to deliver. Appreciate everyone who cops something. Always giving out steals. Yep. Alright. Yep. This one doesn't need one. This one doesn't need one. And dropping off. Yep. Let's go. Alright, what we got in there? What we got in there, bro? Animal fries and the grilled cheese with the regular no salt fries. Give me a burger? No. You don't want one, bro? But yeah, after this, we're gonna head to Buffalo Exchange after Earn Fullerton, and then I got to pick up my merch, my hoodie. I'm excited to show you guys. We're gonna eat, and I'll see y'all later. Oh my god. Hit the like button if y'all hungry. It's cool. Let's go guys. Just got to Buffalo Exchange. We have not been here and I don't even know how long. But since I got a, hey, chill out, chill out. Since I gotta pick up the hoodie out here in um, Orange County area, I figured we'd pop in and just kind of spend the day out here for a little bit. Um, yeah, hopefully we can find some fire. I'm hoping to find like t-shirts. Some nice vintage tees. See what we can find. I don't want to get copyright, but I just came up. Polo Country with the flag on the back. What a heater. Yo, what's good, guys? I just pulled up to the homie's house who's doing my uh, embroidery and screen printing. He's gonna pull out the hoodies. I'm hyped to see what they look like. The finished one. It's gonna be fire. What's up, bro? Oh, man. Chilling, dude. dude, your house looks completely different, bro. <laughs> I was like, wait, am I at the right house? <laughs> Yo, what's good, guys? So I just got back home. I had to stop by the mailbox because I got two packages right here. The boo-boo does not know that I picked her something up from eBay. But as you guys can see right here, this is all the shoes that I came up on today. Um, shout out to the homie for getting the Kobe's. Sadly, I did want those. And I was gonna hoop in them. I was gonna play in those uh, 
the fade to black twos. But it's cool. Um, so I don't know which is which. I'm just gonna open one and then if it's the Boo Boo's package, it's the Boo Boo's package. So we'll see. It was on a Salem tag, but this might be a little hard to. Oh, honey, this is way too hard to open. I need a. Hey. Come on. Come All right, we're gonna open this one first because it needs scissors. I think this one's okay. This one's. Oh my God, this is so fire! Oh, we hey. put it in the black plastic, dude. This shirt is like just as Don't dead that, stock. You can use that. Just as dead Don't stock rip. as the other nutmeg one that I have that's Orlando Magic. If you've been following me, you know that I came up. <laughs> Look at that. Orlando Magic. Little magician right there with the ball is like a crystal ball, size XL, but it does have the back hit. And if you've been following me, you would know. Actually, I have it right here. Stay right there. Mm -hmm. All right, so I just ran to the closet real quick. And this is the one that I thrifted. I don't even know how long ago, but look. This is the one with the bunny on it. This one's a size large, so if you scoop back. How fire is it that I got the magician? and the rabbit this is crazy crazy little combo right here both front and back hits both on the nutmeg and now we got this package once again let me go get something to cut it real quick all right just opened it up with the exacto knife okay people come in with the fire packaging oh, we use that too okay so i got this for the boo-boo High key. I wish this was in my size. She probably don't even know who this is either. But it's a youth size, single stitch purple. So that should give you somewhat of a hint. It is on the Salem tag. But it's not Kobe, it's Nick Van Exel. She probably doesn't know who this is, but this T is fire. I honestly, I really wish this was in my size. This is a crazy one. So now, she has the Kobe Kingdom one, she has this Nick Van Exo one, and then I have one more coming in the mail that she hasn't seen yet. So that'll probably be here in like the next day or so. All right guys, so this is the actual hoodie. I know you guys saw me go pick it up, um, but this is, if you zoom in right there, you see the little center check, but it's actually a dove. So it's a Nike logo inside or combined with the dove. And then on the back, Crazy, big Kobe draft day face. This is a direct to garment, so this is a DTG printing, but I only did it for the um, the photos. The actual one, are gonna, um, they're gonna be screen printed. So it's gonna come out a lot cleaner. But even though, just look at that. This is available on Kobe's anniversary, which is going to be today. So, make sure to go cop. It's on the independent. You already know, we're the coziest in the game, so I made sure it was a super soft hoodie based off the vintage Nike center check, so go cop. All right, guys, so that's going to wrap it up. I hope you guys enjoyed this crazy, crazy, crazy come ups. You already know slogan, so let's wrap it up to the coziest in the game. Amen to fashion, what is good? Peace!